Okay, joining us uh, now to speak on the challenges of bread production in Nigeria is the Chairman, Association of Master Beggars and Caterers of the Federal Capital Territory, Ishak Abdul Rahim. Very warm welcome to Newsnight. Thank you. It's well, bread is, yeah. of course, uh, a big staple of the Nigerian uh, breakfast or Absolutely. lunch or Every dinner day menu. We say and give rest. us our daily bread. <laughs> and uh, it's good because of uh, our own residents, uh, unlike uh, the Arabs, they would have gone on strike with a high cost of. Uh, bread now in the country well what the, the french revolution the french revolution started with the cost of bread, bread and the rest but <laughs> we don't uh, want any no, 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 uh, no, no, quiet no, no. revolution yeah it's okay <laughs> so tell us what uh, revolution uh, are you leading about the high cost of bread in the country that is becoming unaffordable you know sometimes good evening once again mm. sometimes when you fight for something you become incapacitated you just have to be looking and watching to see what will happen why is it like this? Mm -hmm. We have said, we have gone to the media, we have complained, we have gone to Federal Ministry of Trade and Investment that are supposed to be in charge of all these things, complaining that every day prices of these ingredients are increasing. We have not been able to get a solution. I'll give you an example. Right. Two, three weeks ago, a bag of flour was sold 27,300, 400, 500 depending on the brand mm -hmm. two weeks ago they increased two thousand naira on top of it okay. sugar was twenty nine thousand six hundred i went to buy two days ago it is thirty one thousand i bought it now cost of diesel is still there diesel is over two eight ninety now mm -hmm. no power not available and we are asked not to use firewood because of deforestation. Right. So what do we do? We that are producing today, like I will tell you, in FCT here, I know over 30 bakeries that have closed. In, in, in the in space FCT of in how many uh, weeks, in, months, in, or no, year? No, no, in the space of our six months. Over 30 bakeries? Yes, ma. Wow. Because they cannot cope. When you are producing, OK, where, there are some that are fully automated. When you are fully automated, you cannot use any other means of mm. powering your system only diesel because the power is not available now you buy diesel 8, 870 890 mm. depending on the cost how much are you going to cost your ingredients while all other things are also increased how much were we buying it in 2020 a bag of flour is 9500 today is 30000 so how do you cook it almost leaves one speechless. You don't even How know where to start. Uh, well, I mean, now, no, so, in the I face mean, of uh, you, you, this uh, high uh, cost of uh, the condom. That is not make. enough. Right. You see, we complain about all the area councils. Mm -hmm. If you had me in your documentary, I said we want to deal with the area councils directly. Why? Why? Because these uh, contractors they gave, they call them technical partners. They are like the middle middlemen between the agency the area council mm -hmm. and we naturally they will add their own prices to it and we are at the receiving end how do we how do you compete so you find that i, I was uh, there's a but bakery. exactly what do these middlemen do what what are i don't they know why for their business. Business. i don't know the business. Business. area council yeah. use technical partners not all, okay. all the area councils they use technical partners to supervise the to collect revenue for the, on their behalf Ah. And in the process, it's creating... Look, okay, I'll give you an example. Just from two weeks ago, one of the technical partners charged a bakery 2 million naira for 2022 for hazardous waste. What mm. kind of hazardous waste do you have in a bakery? I, I, something hazardous must come like a liquid or something, waste that you produce from chemical Dangerous products. Dangerous chemicals. Where is it? Where do we have such system. in a bakery? Mm. So I, I, these are the... Uh, uh, sorry, uh, uh, yeah. Ishak, uh, just while this conversation is going on, mm. I think the Minister of the Federal Capital Territory and uh, the counterparts, I mean the uh, uh, Minister of State, Federal Capital Territory, who supervises or super, they, who superintends mm. the local council mm. must listen to this so that they can respond appropriately. To what is uh, yeah, saying. To what, yeah. 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 So like I said, two million naira. There are other charges. 
although we in fairness there are some area council that we had an mou okay which is understood but like the technical partners never want to see our faces they want the area council to council that mou why was it what exactly is the mou, MOU? about the mou, MOU the bring we brought about a, a kind of agreement in mm -hmm. such a way of making business easier in amak in guagualada i think those are the major areas in other two area council right. we don't even have much problem like squally and kuje they don't give us problem mm. but on mazes or other area council it is unfortunate so meanwhile what you're saying to us i mean i recall that this year you had gone on strike in the middle of this year yeah and you had actually increased the price of bread up to four times yes are you saying that after you called off your strike nothing has happened mm. on the side of government before the strike the price of flour was about 26,000 plus. After the strike, immediately after the strike, they increased it to about 28,000. Before mm -hmm. it was another increase to another 29,400 or 500. Mm -hmm. Now it is 30,000. 30, Sugar is 31,000. Initially, before the, it was 27, 28, it went to 30. Yeah, what I'm 31. asking, what we're trying to find out yeah, is yeah. how has government responded at the different levels? The response to, from government, you know, you, yes, your strike. What been, exactly were your demands? They called us to Federal Ministry of Trade and Investment, and we lodged our complaints. They said they are going to look into it. We are still waiting for them to respond. There has not been a positive response to this time. Now, in 20, um, I mean, under the Jonathan administration, there was this 15%, you know, wheat development levy that was meant to, to help, uh, you know, grow uh, wheat locally. Mm. Uh, it, it's shocking that 99% of wheat is imported, actually. The, the, the nation <laughs> and you only, have the uh, Ukraine, you know, yeah. uh, uh, Russia war that's impacted greatly on uh, wheat importation. Mm -hmm. What exactly are you doing as an association to look yes, seriously into you know, sourcing wheat locally. Growing we, it first, and of course sourcing it. Yes, federal government just launched, I, I, like they did in rice and uh, maize. maize. Mm -hmm. The same program has been launched by federal government to begin production of right. wheat in Nigeria. Mm -hmm. We had it about two months ago. We are still waiting for the implementation of that. Nothing has been done for now until when the, the proper implementation. So it's only just on paper. Yes. So Nigeria yes. still produces just 60,000 uh, tons of wheat. In fact, the millers. Oh, okay, let's uh, ask you. The Federal Minister of Agriculture, the um, flour mills, you know, I don't want mm. to mention their names mm. without giving them undue advertisements right. and the rest. How have they, you know, helped in this matter? Has your association reached out to them, you know, to talk about the spiraling effect mm. of a high cost of uh, the condiments used in uh, producing, bread. yeah, in baking bread? Yes, our counterpart, that is the Lagos State Chairman, and the national body went to all the flour millers this month mm. to protest the incessant increase in all these flour companies. They went to all the flour companies in Lagos to tell them that we are tired of this thing. We will take the next action if they cannot revert the prices of these commodities. Mm -hmm. But, but mm -hmm. why isn't your association uh, looking inwards? Like the federal government, I mean, in its development plans, whether short, medium, medium or long term, term, will tell you integrated or looking inwards. inwards. and you know backward um, integration backward integration mm. uh, the jonathan administration to did the cassava the, bread that, and the yeah. rest and what, what happened to that what we, happened why are you not pursuing that thank you very much sir we have said it much much earlier than now if five percent of cassava is included it will save nigeria billions of dollars but unfortunately mm. i don't know why the flour millers have not agreed to be including 5% or 10% as recommended into the flour. We are, we are expected, which we, can, we said we will not do. We will not be going to buy cassava outside and then starting to mix it up with a bag of flour. Mm -hmm. It was done during Jonathan. Right. They call it composite flour. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It contains 5 or 10% of cassava, mm -hmm. at which if we produce it, you would never know that it that's, is that's that's any, they will never know. Mm -hmm. Now that one has been phased out. We have not seen it again. Why is that? That is, ask the mailers. Oh gee. Okay. 
you were talking about the issue of regulators, the yes. challenges with NAFDAQ mm -hmm. and other regulators. You want to quickly we had, address we that? We have, we have two challenges. Number one, NAFDAQ and so on. Virtually everything NAFDAQ is doing, so on is doing the same thing. The, our products are satisfied. You have to go to laboratory. If you are in NAFDAQ, you have to go to laboratory in Sun, you have to uh, do man cap in Sun, you have to get NAVDAC number. Duplication, in a, duplication of duplication duplication. Duplication. and the rest. Now, just yeah. frustrating so just, the small yeah, exactly, video of the exactly, scale enterprise. Exactly. Well, we'll have to exactly. leave it there. Mr. Ishak Abdurrahim is yeah. Chairman Association of Master Bakers FCT. We wish you the very best and hopefully the bread never leaves our dining table. Yes. Oh, yes. Even though thank, we don't have to so leave much. by I'm bread. Thank you so much. I'm very grateful and happy to be here. Thank you very thank much. You. Thank you.